I'm carrying this, am I? Yeah. We're going to Draclow. Come on. So here we are, one of my favourite places, Draclow. It's a Derbyshire Wildlife Trust reserve and uh, it's really good for bird watching. You get some really good species here. Let's have a walk around and see what we can find. And one of the great things about today is t-shirts. Oh. <laughs> Apart from Lynn, she's still dressed for winter, but it's absolutely lovely. What a morning to be out. is excellent. It's such a nice place to come. If you haven't been, definitely, definitely get yourself here. You need to be a member though, that's the thing. So if you're not a member of the Darwish Wildlife Trust, join. Because it's for reserves like this and the work that they do around the county that it's worth, definitely worth joining. I don't know if the hides at Draco have actually got names or not, I don't think they have. But this is certainly one of my favourite ones looking out onto this pond. And it's not very often you get people coming this far around either, so you generally get it to yourself. And if you look over there, I'll try and zoom in a little bit, you'll notice a heronry. I've not counted how many nests yet, but I think there's three or four. <laughs> We've got warblers singing all over the place today, it's fantastic. 
probably hear that chiff chaff behind me. It's so nice to hear the sedge warblers again. Black caps as well, beautiful. We're trying our best with these chetty's warblers. They're singing everywhere. There must be four or five birds singing. And we keep seeing these little brown glimpses with it flying across. But picking one out, if you've ever tried to see a chetty's warbler, you know exactly what I'm talking about. They just skulk right in the depths of the, you know, the scrub. So, although we've seen one, we haven't seen a really good view of one. So we were going to go to the hide, which is that way, but as you can see, it's footpath flooded. So we ain't going to there today. I was hoping to get a sedge warbler there, but... I don't know if this mic can pick up behind me, but <laughs> there's also a reed warbler here now as well. And I've just been recording it audio-wise on the audio recorder. A minute and a half of non-stop sound. But can I bugger us find it? So the photographs of these warblers are a bit thin on the ground today, because they're all hiding. But to hear them and know that they're back is brilliant. <laughs> it's going again, must be another minute and a half. Would you believe it? We're about to take shelter in one of the hoods, it started raining. Still, chance to rest your feet. We might get something coming to the feeders. Mm -hmm. 